So uh, our product is called RubyMotion. RubyMotion is an implementation of the Ruby language for uh, mobile development. It allows Ruby programmers to write uh, mobile apps. The main focus of RubyMotion these days is cross-platform development. It allows you to target both iOS and Android. Most mobile developers these days uh, want to target iOS and Android devices. They don't. They no longer want to target only iOS and only Android. And um, so cross-platform is very important. But RubyMotion is very different from other uh, products in the sense that it's uh, real native development. So you can share the same language across iOS and Android. You get to call into existing native APIs each time. There is no bridge technology. So it's very efficient. In terms of, in terms of businesses, it allows uh, Ruby developers basically to uh, work on mobile apps. Most companies these days have Ruby developers to do uh, web apps, so they can now do mobile application as well. This is, uh, this is the second uh, pre-advantage of RubyMotion over other, other products. If you already have Ruby developers, they can already uh, work on mobile uh, development and uh, as well as um, web development. So they can start working on iOS and Android apps. We have a free version of RubyMotion as well. Since a few months ago, it's completely free, so everyone can download it. And we also have different packages from uh, indie subscriptions to enterprise subscriptions. Enterprise subscriptions come with uh, SLA support. And, and that's all. Arigato gozaimasu. I was very happy. So I, I, was, I was originally a Perl per programmer at university, but then I had to write um, a code base, and I couldn't understand the code base anymore. It's a bit technical, but I had to switch from Perl to Ruby. It was in 2001, 2002, and since then I've been using Ruby. I think Ruby, uh, Ruby, Ruby will be more popular in the future. I think Ruby has a good uh, future. I think that thanks to this award, we will, we will get more promotion in Japan. And maybe we'll build more customer in Japan. Maybe try to target bigger Japanese companies.